Hello, in this tutorial I will teach you how to install and uninstall Homebrew Package Manager on your Mac operating system. First we will start with installation of Homebrew Package Manager. Open homebrew.sh on your browser and you will find a command for installing Homebrew. We have to run this command from macOS terminal. So let's open our terminal and paste this command as it is and click enter. Now enter your password and you will see all the information of directories which will be created with this installation. So just press enter that is return button on your Mac and that's it the installation of homebrew is completed. We can verify with the simple homebrew command brew list and if there is no error it means our installation is successful. Now I will show you an example of how to install any software using homebrew how to find installation commands. For finding your target software just once again go to your home screen and if you scroll down a little bit you will find a link to homebrew packages which says formulae.brew.sh and if you open this link you will see list of softwares which you can install so for this example let's say I want to install software called Jmeter so I can just find this link uh, sorry this command and I, if I run this command from terminal the installation will start so you can see that Geometer installation has started easily and the installation is done to a particular directory. If I go to this directory and find the script in this directory for that software, I can easily open this software or run this software. That's it. You can see that the software is installed and started already. Okay, so now we will see how to uninstall or remove homebrew from your Mac operating system. You can find command for uninstallation from homebrew's git home or I will add it in description. Just run this command from your terminal. You will get a warning message with information what all will be deleted. Accept the warning. Enter the password. Uninstallation process has been completed but homebrew will keep few files as it is for us to clean up. So you can ignore that part and we will go ahead and just try to see if brew is still present our, in our system. So I will run a sample command brew list and now you can see that there is an error message command not found. This means that homebrew is no longer present in your system and it is successfully uninstalled. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe our channel.